Hey guys, welcome back to the kitchen. If you're new here, welcome. And to my subscribers, welcome back. Today I'll be cutting a whole chicken into about eight pieces. So if you like these types of videos, just keep watching. Okay guys, so the first thing we need to get started, of course, is the chicken. I'm also gonna be using a chef knife and some kitchen scissors. I'm gonna start by removing the legs by finding that little space in between, between the breast and the thigh and make a slit. So I don't know, right, if you can, this one has a lot of skin. So once you've made the slit, you can see what's going on in the inside. So you're just going to feel for that bone. Are you you're gonna feel for that bone right there and just pop it out no if you can see that and just pop it out right there if you can see it right there so the bone is out right there so I can actually cut Cut right through. See? So, so this is the bone right here that you would feel for and just pop it right out. So I'm gonna do the same thing for this side. Once again, let me turn this so you guys can see. So once again, find that little space. This is one fatty bird. <laughs> Right, so you find that space right there. Right, you feel, you feel for the bone and you just pop it out right there. And just cut. There you go. All right, so next you wanna cut the, the wing off. And if you hold the chicken, you're gonna feel for a little, a little joint, I would say, to where the wing is connected to the breast. So you just feel for that joint right there. Keep going around, cut. right there and you have your wing. So next thing, we're gonna remove the backbone. Now the backbone is usually used when they're, when you're making a chicken uh, chicken stock they use the backbone to make chicken stock All right so let me wipe my hands just a little bit because it's kind of slippery so for the backbone i'm gonna use my kitchen scissors and just cut cut all the way down All right, just cut, cut all the way down. And there you have the backbone. 
that you can use for chicken stock. All right, so next up is the chicken breast. So just let me just cut some of these uh, fatty pieces away. All right, so this is, this is the backbone right here. So what I'm gonna do is just make, just make a slit right there just to make it easier. Flip it over and you wanna press down really hard. Right, and of course the line is, I'm trying to remove this so you can see. So the, the chicken actually has like a, its own cut lines, like it has like exactly where you're supposed to cut it. So it's very, it's designed to just tell you <laughs> where to cut it, so. So. Cut all the way down. And there's our breast. We just cut some more of the fat away. So that's your chicken breast right there. All right, so we have the wings, we have the legs, and we have the chicken breast. So let's try to get the chicken thighs. So now if you look on it, there's a there's a fat line right here. And again, the chicken is, is I don't know, I guess God created this, but it's set up in a way where you can actually see where you need to cut. I was told that this is like the fat line that you will follow in order to cut the uh, drumstick from the, the thigh. So again, this little fault line right here, the fat that's right here, helps you to cut the, the thigh from the drumstick. Again, that's the thigh from the drumstick, that little uh, fault line, that little fat line. So you'll just follow that all the way through. And here you have your drumstick and your thigh without all of that fat. So this would be a thigh right here. All right, so let me do that one more time. So we have our leg right here. So drumstick and thigh. So again, you just follow this line right here, this little fat line in order to separate the two. So again, right here. Drumstick and thigh. So let me clean myself up and I'll be right back. All right guys, so there we have it. One whole chicken cut into eight pieces. We have our two breasts, our two drumsticks, Our wing, two wing, two wings. And we have our two ties. I hope this was easy enough. So don't let cutting an entire chicken daunt you. It's really not a daunting process. And it's also cheaper to buy a whole chicken and cut it into the pieces that you want. So I hope this was helpful. I hope it's gonna be useful. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and hit the bell so you get notified every Friday when I post. Bye!